Here you can check out a bit of the dog show in Puerto oh, Moyas, yeah, Panama. Yeah. Betsy from Living in Panama, the place for information and advice on being an expat in Panama. Interested? Click subscribe and hit the bell so you don't miss a video. Well, this dog show was really over when we arrived. They were giving out prizes and taking photos of it. Turns out, even though we had thought it was over and we had come late because we didn't think it was starting right away, there's two parts of the dog show and we were pulled into it happily for my daughter there with her our dog Ziggy because she had wanted to put her dog in but Veronique who was going to, with the cast we had told about this dog show so she's happily in it but Cheryl that you see there she was just coming over to have us help her fix something I mean, we were told we were going to be there and so we could fix it while we were there but we were all pulled into the second part and you can see there's little obedience checks whether the uh, dog can come to you whether it'll sit they do one round of that and then they have the audience give their input they base the prizes on how much applause each person got pretty much everyone got some dog food here's an interesting cultural item you can easily think that everything happens late in Panama you know Relax, lifestyle, things tend to come late, but not everything. When my husband was at Romero's, they said the dog show was going to be starting in just a few minutes, and my husband looked around and said it didn't look like it was going to start for at least an hour. But it started right away. When we showed up about an hour and 20 minutes later, it was pretty much over, in the main part at least. And so that is uh, it's something we should have known that the dog show would start on time there's certain things that start on time it's just one of those things you kind of have to learn over time what things start on time and what things are likely to be very very late and one thing i do like about panama is there's no pre-registration i mean maybe for the first part people pre-registered but if, i'm sure if you showed up you could still participate in that and here we were completely not prepared for the second part and it was fine. You don't not necessary to do a lot of pre-planning in your life and I love that about Panama. Click below for more information about Puerto Muelles. Thanks for watching. Okay, great.